needed was to learn what you wouldn't get from Jeremy Baxman or from the Daily Mail. You get meetings like this information. And uh, I was asked to join in the discussion of the overview. Well, we've heard some horrific things today, not least of the accounts of the trial of an American American attitude to law. But I hope I won't surprise you if I say I think the main impression, an overview I have today, is one of exhilaration. I think it's very, very important that we see what is happening in the world, not as a story of doom and gloom and disaster, but as a turning point. That's why the phrase another world is possible is so important. Let's be absolutely clear. The American Empire is in decline. There's no question about it.
there uh, good friend, and this is the world we live in. And so the overview I have of this conference should go away absolutely determined to carry on with the struggle and send our support to those who've got a harder job to do than we have in facing new labour and not allow anyone to be defected from the feeling it can't be done. I saw a, a, a website the other day and I finished by recommending it to you. It's called Map, um, www.maps of war. And it's a history of the Middle East over the last 5,000 years. And it takes 90 seconds to watch. And what it is, you see all the empires on the maps coming and going, and coming and going. Hittite Empire, Babylonian Empire, Egyptian Empire, Greek Empire, and this empire will go. And no, there is no destination known as peace or socialism if you catch the right train. Every generation has to struggle again. And I'm really glad to have lived to see a generation now that is engaged in that struggle. But I also know quite well my grandchildren will have to do it all over again. Come